Okay, round three against Chohin. I'm gonna play. Hmm. Herd Mother is a 9 9. That's not as good as an 8 10. And I'd like drawing cards with a raid when they. I'm already triggering the raid, so let's just play Matriarch and then hopefully draw a Sorrow Maiden and Patron. Well, there's Sorrow Maiden, I'll take that. I haven't had a chance to play Sorrow Maiden yet. Uh, this is my first time. Uh, so I might get to play Sorrow Maiden Twin Strength or Sorrow Maiden Rothine. Could also see Sorrow Maiden Torg my Mender, but that doesn't seem as good as Sorrow Maiden Twin Strength. <laughs> There's a zombie titan, so yeah, I'm definitely using Twin Strength. Uh, looks like he's playing in the side lane. And a Metamine Operator doesn't really do anything. Maybe he's setting up for Infernal Visage? That's the only thing I can think of. In which case it would be a 612 with one regen, which is, you know, a decent card. Uh, but if he doesn't have, if he doesn't draw the Visage, i just kill it with Sara <laughs> Which is pretty embarrassing for him. Uh, he can always Grave Pact my Sorrow Maiden, but other than that, I think that's the only card that deals with it. Because it'd have to be a Necron card, because none of the Alloyan cards do that. If he Energy Prisons it, that's like the only removal in Alloyan, I still get the ability off. And I drew my two, my two good Uterra Horux. The one that isn't Stygian Lotus or Fido Bomb. <laughs> I, I hate on Stygian Lotus a lot when I'm drafting, and I know a lot of people just watch the drafts and don't watch the games, but... I, it's really, really clear when you watch the games why I don't like Stygian Lotus, because the card just is blank a lot of the times. You have to have something that works with it, like Harbinger of Spring. Otherwise, the card is just really, really bad stats. Even if it's a lot of them, it's a lot of creatures with really bad stats, and it takes up an entire play. So, anyway, uh, we'll play Patron first, because I want to get the Allied Trigger. Play that there, kill his creature, then play Gem Hide Ravager in the, uh, I guess the side lane, since I can play in the center lane. Uh, this It does die to Zombie Titan this way, but I can't really prevent that. I guess I can Torg my mid right now, and then play Fell Strider, I guess? It's probably my be next best card. Though, I'll probably play Tuscan Grove Giver just because it's a 6 6. I didn't level anything to Herd Mothers, so I don't really need to keep. Ooh, Sonic Pulse is pretty good here. Uh, Sonic Pulse is always a really solid card when your opponent's really far ahead of you. Uh, so that those two cards trade. I can Torg my Mender it back up, which you know, is the best card in my hand. And then play Grove Keeper. Uh, ch ch kill the Scorpion with Tuscan Grove Keeper. And then pump up my Sorrow Maiden to keep it alive one turn longer. Uh, it just means he has to block it again. So I get three extra damage on the, the next creature he plays. Uh, that's basically all that means. I even gained one life off my <laughs> my uh, my gem Eye Ravager. Uh, so I'm going to play Sorrow Maiden and Evan Skull Knight. I don't want to play the Grove Keeper because it's a 12-12 at rank 3, but this is a 13 power at rank 3, which is a lot better. Especially if he's playing stuff like Metamite Operator and Steel Skin Splunker, things that add extra toughness. Okay, so that unsurprisingly just kills my Sorrow Maiden. Pulse Mage is a little weird, but that's fine, I guess. I'm just going to throw a Sorrow Maiden in front of it, because it's... Actually, I can throw a Sorrow Maiden in the empty lane, and then play Evan Skull Knight in front of this. Um, Evan Skull Knight minus 4 is 5 power, so it still kills the, the Hulk. And, I mean, my Gem Hide Ravager will die, but at least it does 2 damage, so I can block with a 4 power creature if I have one. Don't have one. I have... Like a Torg Mimander Savage with hand. It's <laughs> kind of weird, but that's what I've got. So I've got three Necron cards left in my deck. If I draw Patron, it's really likely to trigger. I'm probably going to play Savage with uh, uh, Torg Mimander for sure, and then maybe one of these two pump spells, depending on which is better for the situation. Uh, Twin Strength can pump my Necron cards, but Savage with levels way better. Uh, gets plus six, plus six next rank instead of. Plus four was worth two creatures, but plus fifteen plus fifteen is the real, the real draw. And if he's playing Sonic pulses and uh, you know other cards like that, it's gonna go late. So, I, but you know when he blocks his, my creature with that's okay. I thought he would just decrease the damage that's being dealt to him. Maybe he has a cold week or didn't count or I don't know something like that. Fell Strider. Okay, so Felstrider just dies to my Sorrow Maiden. 
Yep, so what I do is play kill this with Sorrow Maiden, block the uh, Mender here, and then pump my Sorrow Maiden's health, and then Twin Strength, my Sorrow Maiden, and my... Uh, I think I want to get the... I can't find out how to target this Torgoy Mender, but I'm pretty sure I want that over the Oven Skull. That's uh, what, plus 3, so it'd be a 12-6. You know, 12-6 is fine. But if he blocks a Zombie Titan, I'm going to feel pretty bad. Zombie Titan's a 10, 10 so that would trade evenly with a Pumped toward my vendor. Um, I'll block the Evans Go. I'll pump the Evans Go to get him more damage. More damage uh, forces a trade with a larger creature, or gets more damage on a larger creature if he doesn't have any good six power creatures. Six is a really awkward toughness because not a level, a lot of level one cards block it. But a lot of level 2 cards are like, it's a harder to get a level 1 6 power creatures than it is level 1 3 power creatures. But anyway, he decided that was enough for him. Much like I did last game, his, my board was just too good. I have a, a what, I think it's an 11 12 Zara Maiden, which is really hard to deal with uh, with the cards he had displayed previously. Especially his leveled Zombie Titan when I only have Torgmine Menders in the side lane. And that was like the best creature he played. But anyway, uh, that puts me at 2 1, I think. I'm so bad at keeping track of my record. Uh, yep, 2-1. So I'll see you all for round four.